I'm gonna tell CJ something. Stop, stop it out on the internet. You gotta, you gotta quit. For the sake of your court case, you you can't go, you can't be doing this, big dog. You gotta leave this alone. He gonna be playing for, <laughs> he gonna be playing in Pelican Bay, shoe program. <laughs> Uh, stay positive and blessed. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna get to what Lexi and Royalty said, you know. Um, but I, I just had to point this out because, uh, yeah, CJ, he just needs to stop this. He needs to stop, um, putting this energy out on line with this open custody case because it it doesn't it doesn't harm him. He's actually speaking the truth. But, but again, remember that behavior conduct rule that they had in that um in that agreement that I have. I'm pretty sure there's something about that. Like he don't need to be speaking uh, ill will to about the kid's mom online, and not that this is speaking directly to her, but with him calling. Uh, um, Rico, a drug addict, aka cokehead. You know what I'm saying? With him doing that, that could possibly be like he's uh, terrorizing me. He's doing this, you know. I'm just saying. So there's that. CJ just cut that out. Um, but you can you can keep commenting and saying you know laughing and respecting people, but don't bring her up because it's only gone. It's only going, she could use it against you. Not saying she is, because I wouldn't use this against me. Or um, if somebody was calling the person that I hang with a drug addict and that person has like recent encounters with the police for drugs, possession and stuff like that and paraphernalia. Yeah, I wouldn't use this per se, but I'm saying it could still, you know. Anyway, so I, I'm sure was, when he got wind of this, that's when he said cj so cool check your dm now does he want to have a peaceful conversation like maybe royalty and uh what's that girl name lexi had I think royalty and lexi had a good healthy conversation i believe so i believe so but i'm gonna just be honest um uh, there had to be some apologies made there had to be a few apologies made I thought she was being a little confrontational. Now listen, now, I mean, it was just how she was standing. I think I seen somebody said in the chat that they said how her hands was moving. And I was I was looking at that too and I was like, yeah, she's probably just trying to defend herself. Well, well you know, this happened, this happened. No, 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 no. You called out Nike for a fight. She came down there with Nike. And y'all fought. Now, your mama was doing all this other stuff. And then that you and her mama got it to us. So and now, think about it like this. That next kid party going to be awkward because your mama going to be there. Lexi going to be there. You know what I'm saying? If y'all even have a joint kid party. Because I know you don't celebrate birthdays or whatever kind of nonsense. The other side is crazy. They said CJ is spreading false info. And they said royalty was going off on Lexi. And her mom and Lexi was so scared. Okay, that's that's what I'm saying. Like, why would why would royalty want to go off on Lexi? I, I I thought she said she was squashing it. So I don't. I think if the other if the other side is saying that they crazy, like they they're actually like I said when they trying to keep the beef going. When I said earlier, like us as content creators, we do gotta hold some type of standard on what we talk about and what we do. And we kind of keep the BS going. I know I do, but that's all in fun and jokes. I mean, people make all type of stuff about me, but they don't be joking. They be dead ass serious. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't apologize to the royalty about 50 times. I apologize to her now. I really don't mean, I don't care. I don't really mean this stuff about her. You know what I'm saying? Even though she trying to, you know, she trying to do low all my channels. But hey, man, it is what it is. You know, I wouldn't like it either, but you know, 
I mean, it's just what it is. It's not like she's trying to stop the, the nonsense that we talked about her, or talked about about CJ on other channels that she really supports and jumps out on DM, shouts them out, and all this stuff, that all this extra stuff. Like, I mean, shout out to them, though. I mean, I guess if that's what they want to do, but that don't make her look any better. You know what I mean? It ain't, <laughs> you know? So anyway, but Alexi's mama was, you know, standing out front, um, kind of in between. Well, I mean, you couldn't really tell who was, like, closer to royalty. And I don't think it was, like, any, uh, there was no aggression. But I do think they was making some, uh, they was trying to get some clarification on about the, probably about the situation. But let's remember, royalty called, um, Lexi a B I T C H several times. You know what I'm saying? A white one at that. You know what I'm saying? So it's you know, so I mean, I'm glad they just squashed it. You know, it could be water under the bridge. Now, the only people that's going it's a lot of people that's been coming up talking negatively about the situation. Like I mean, they should have did this a long time ago. You know what I mean? But the kids, she wasn't letting the kids be around CJ. You know what I mean? So since she wasn't letting the kids be around CJ, of course, of course they couldn't have made this happen. So, but it's glad she got out ahead of it now because, I mean, she knew it was going to happen. So she had to do what any mother does and be like, look, okay. I gotta suck it up. I can't be acting like a child. I need to go meet um, Lexi. Okay, and Lexi's mom was like, well, I'll meet her with you because I don't trust her. And I wouldn't, you know? Here's the thing. They wanted Lexi to man or to woman up and go meet royalty. Those ain't Lexi's kids. Lexi don't need to meet royalty. Royalty needs to meet Lexi. That was the fact. And, and royalty did what she was supposed to do. That's, you know, uh, I heard they was I heard people saying, uh, well, uh, Lexi don't need to be around them kids if she ain't met the mama. What kind of woman would do that? That's, that's CJ bringing the kids around. If CJ wants to bring his kids around and meet his girlfriend that he's been with, um, that's that's his choice. Think about how many people introduced their kids to a man on the first time they met. Like they go a man to go to the girl's house and the kids just running around. I didn't I didn't been there. I didn't been in some women's house when I first met them and they got kids, you know. And I'm just like, dog, I don't even know you. You, you should have had your kids somewhere else. We should have met met somewhere else. But at the end of the day, who cared? You know what I'm saying? I didn't care. If she didn't care, I didn't care. You know what I mean? That's just the way it is. Who? I mean, CJ's views is low. Man, so what, man? I mean, I mean, people ain't going to be happy for you for, for anything. Like, like, okay. Like, i will never be happy for royalty. The only thing I was happy for, that she came to her senses and talked to Lexi. Like, that's... That's probably the most important thing that I could ever see her doing that would make me be like, oh, she's a decent person. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, <laughs> you know, that that's just being honest. Like, there's so much more going on in life that, you know, it's, 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 you don't want to have beef with the woman that's around your kids, okay? You just don't want to do that. All right, we, we've seen a lot of stuff going on in life. Uh, what if something happened to to her? We don't want that to happen, but I'm just saying that person will be the worst person in front of your kids every day, okay? Because your kids will definitely go to CJ. Now, now your the older, older three, they're going to go with whoever they're going to go with. Um, probably the mama. <laughs> Not Uncle Van, look at that.